visit Denmark and Blast are teaming up to put two of Counter-Strike's all-stars, Dupree and Kerrigan, to the test in their home turf of Denmark. Their first channels will bring them to the magnificent Kronborg Castle, a true Danish treasure stepped in history. Wow! Kumba! Thank you! Thank you! And goodbye! See you! What do we have here, Finn? I see Blast logo. You ready to read this one? Yeah. Let's go, let's go. Dear players, welcome to Kronbo. Right this, this beautiful one right here. Today's first task will take place at this magnificent castle. You will both be challenged in a historical duel that will put your skill set to a test. Oh no. You will be doing a one versus one duel in fencing. Good luck and may the best man win. That sounds serious, bro. I know my moves already. I'm, <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking forward to this. It's gonna be awesome. All right, guys, welcome to Cornball. I heard you guys are fencing today. A little bit of a duel. Yes, yes, for sure. Unfinished business. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to go through the basics today. I'm going to show you some basic moves. We're thinking uh, best out of three. We're, we're fencing here. The whole body counts. This is the original dueling weapon. Nice and flexible, but very stiff. Jackets will keep us safe from any uh, piercings. Uh, squat, turn your body to the side. Weapon out. And then it's supposed to be pointing at my shoulder. Yeah, so... <laughs> <Are you going? laughs> like that? Yeah. Beautiful. Salutes. Start from uh, your feet here at a 90 degree angle. Tip down. Up. Under your chin. And out to the side. Bonus points if you get the swish. Ah, okay. Wait, watch out. <laughs> Step back. <laughs> yeah. That was a little bit yeah. swish. Yeah, that, were, that was a good one. All right, start with the salute. Up, under the chin, and then out to the side. First round of three, on guard. Play, Ali. Up, on guard. Play, Ali. Up, deux fois, on guard. Allez. What? Defensive tactic working. Come on, Dupree. On guard. Prêt? Allez. What? Nice shot. On guard. Prêt? Allez. What? Kerrigan wins the first round. Second round. Fence is ready? Yes. Yes. On guard. Prêt? Allez. <laughs> <laughs> On guard, prêt, allez. Up, two, trois, perfect. On guard, prêt, allez. Up, two, trois. On guard, prêt, allez. Up. Now, Dupree, remember, if Kerrigan gets his last point, he wins the whole duel. So, clutch your kick, Dupree. On guard, prêt, allez. Up, two, trois. <laughs> Third and final round. Dupree has one victory. Kerrigan has one victory. This is the round that settles it all, gentlemen. On guard. Prêt. Allez. Halt. Touche. Trois. On guard. Prêt. Allez. Halt. Touche. Trois. The good is not best of ten. On guard. Prêt. Allez. Oh, that's unfair. Replay. Oh, Re sorry, man. Restore wrong. Restore wrong. <laughs> on guard. Prêt. Allez. Halt. You only live once. But whoever gets the next point wins the round. Let's go, Phil. <laughs> Sit down. I'm coming for you. On guard. Prêt. Allez. <laughs> Dupree wins. <laughs> <laughs> Good match, guys. The next task will lead the players northward, 
to the beautiful region of North Zealand. Thank you, and have a good day. Great to see you. Bye bye. What do you think it is? I don't know. It's interesting. Ta -da! Dear players, me and you, Mr. Dupre. Denmark is known as one of the gastronomy capital of the world. With attention to detail, today's second task will be a cooking competition. Both will be tested in who can make the best looking meal. Let's see who can stay focused and take the win. May the best chef win. Good luck. Thank you. You too. And look at this beautiful scenery. We are going in to cook some amazing food. Uh, welcome to Restaurant Fyrkron. We will make Danish uh, smørbrød. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna take a step back and visualize and Wait, see what you're doing. And see what I'm doing. Yeah. I think that's a, that's a good plan. Well, just stop looking at me. Okay, well, I'm supposed to look to the water. First of all, let's take a look at these beauties. All right, I'll start with the hard one. So what are you thinking you want to do? I am gonna do the... The ligustin. Ligustin, yes. Gonna do a tower. Let's see if they can stand. And you are making the potatoes. Yeah, I'm trying to make the potato here. Nobody's gonna move my plate, right? It's not going as expected. Are you cooking a lot at home? Depends if my wife is watching right now. Um, so just to be sure, not at all. <laughs> <laughs> I think I cook uh, quite a lot at home, actually. I'm just trying to make, make new stuff all the time. We need this special flour. The onion flour. The onion flour. Holy, that looks... How did you do that? What do you mean? It's easy. So Peter, being good at Counter-Strike, does that correlate with uh, you staying here and cooking? Since I'm on the bench, yes. That means we have more time now. You see? That's actually unfair. He's bench, he has time to cook. I don't have time. I have practice in two hours. It's not that bad, Finn. Thank you. I'm trying to do a smiley now. You don't want to use the fried eggs you made? I think that's a hint. I think on the side here, so a guest has an X option oh, to, yes. to eat it, and if they feel like that's, that's how it looks, because it looks so beautiful now. Yeah. Putting outside the bread is also fine. It's part of the look, right? Yes, that's us. OK, OK, yeah. good. <laughs> the potato over here could be like a children that make it. <laughs> I think there's a lot to it. There's a lot of, like, one thing is that you can make it look nice. Yeah. But then there's also the part that you obviously yeah. has to taste good. I'm done. You're nice, Finn. So uh, you're both finished? Yes. So what would we call the smart ball here? I think on the, on the right side we have a classic uh, kartoffel meal. Yes. It's basically potatoes. There's some, uh, some pickled red onions. There's some radish with some lime mayo. Some, uh, a little bit of garnish on top. And obviously over here we have the Another one, the yeah. langoustine with the same type of mayo, pickled red onions, and also crunch on top. <laughs> <laughs> this is Tornado John. Yeah. And this is uh, Sunny Potato Man. Yeah. Okay. Looks good. <laughs> yes, I love it. I think I will start with the langoustine. Ooh. Fun. Yeah. Tornado John. Tornado John. Yes. Yes. That right. It looks right. It looks good. <laughs> Not, yeah. that bad, Not that bad. Not that bad. Well done, Finn. Hmm? Well done. Very good. Thank you. And the mayonnaise it with lemon? Yes. Yes. Yeah, I have a very specific one. Yes. That's okay. Yeah. yeah. It looks good and tastes very good. That's a good start. I think it's a good idea with the egg. Yeah, it's on the side. It's like a how <laughs> that's at the house that fell, you know? Maybe you couldn't put it up here and make some herbs around. Tornado John can be like a tsunami yes. next time. <laughs> <laughs> and now I want to try your Peters. Yes. Yes. There's no egg on this? No. No. There's no egg. I don't think it did something, but the, I think it would look... I, you know, now you're trying to influence no, the judge. It yes, you messy. are. It's... I couldn't figure it out. And I think you have to take the normal mayo. Oh, no. The lemon is a little bit better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I agree. So I think in the taste, I think this one was uh, a little bit better because you have the lemon mayonnaise, and I think the eggs was a very good idea to put on. It makes it special. Yeah, yeah, yeah I agree, I agree. And this one, yeah, it looks very beautiful. So I think this one will win in the how it looks, and this will take the, for the taste. The taste, yes. Yeah. So that's one point for each or what? Yes, I will give you one and one. Yeah. And now we will go to the potatoes. We have Peter's here. It looks uh, beautiful. And here I think you have get some help from a child that was here late. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, I think I will start with this. I smell a free one to me. Yeah. <laughs> and now we will taste this. Remember, Finn, you also eat with the eyes. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's not fair. That's not how it looked in the beginning. <laughs> I think we have a winner here from the most beautiful and the most tasting. 
Yeah, I'm not. A, no, I'm not a potato guy. That oh, you're not a potato. No. No. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I was a little bit surprised in the beginning. That was. It was. You were doing pretty well in that one. So that was one's like, good. And then you started making that. And I was like, what are you doing? Okay, I guess uh, I lost this task. The other one was draw. I got you won this one, but last one was draw. So say the last task. It must be the deciding one. The first uh, one I think draw. if you ask the, the finishing coach, I think he, he said yeah, that I won. Yeah, but it looked like he was bored for a second. But anyway, you won this one fair and square. I can agree on that. But yeah, looking forward to the next one. I hear water, but I have no idea if that's what we're going to do. I hope there's going to be water involved. Finally, the last task of the day will take the players to the stunning Danish coastline, where they can enjoy the breathtaking views of the sea and the charm of Denmark's coastal towns. I thought I would see you in a wet suit, fam. No, nice suit, man. You too. Ah, I think this one will tell us what we're doing. <laughs> Have a nice day again. See you later. Bye bye. Nice. Whoa. Okay. Dear players, last and final challenge will happen right here at the beautiful Danish coastline of Sealand. Do you think it's that way? I think it's out there, yeah. This time we will have to leave solid ground and venture into the sea. Whoever picks and collects the chicken the fastest and have the fastest lap while being on a paddleboard wins. Good luck. Have you tried this before? Uh, yes. Oh, rub. <laughs> Who's taking time? He started now, no? Oh, it's looking good, Peter. It's looking good. Keep going left. Yeah, keep going left. Go more left, more left. Shut up. He doesn't want to speak to me. Get the chicken, it's drowning. Get the chicken. Chicken. Chicken, chicken. What's happening, Peter? Talk to me. I can't get it off. It's fine. Just tell me how you're doing it after. Hey. It's over four minutes now. <laughs> you have chicken in your mouth? <laughs> Seven minutes past now. I'm coming home, <laughs> Save the chicken. 17 minutes and 40 seconds. So I made it in three minutes, Finn. Now it's your turn to go and collect your chicken. Do you think you can do better than me? No. No? No. Well, you better get moving. OK, I'll stop now. I hope you're not going to go into the water. I will, for sure. Oi! Yeah, fit! <laughs> this is what they call SDP. That stands for sit down battle. Up a stop fit! Get up, stand up fit! It's called stand up paddle for a reason! <laughs> now you need to get the chicken fit! Chicken! Okay, I think he's doing worse than me. What are you doing? I don't know what I'm doing. Just grab the damn thing so you can hold on to it. I got it. Yeah. Let's go fit. You look like a pro. Time. I'm very, very proud of you. That was so good. It's called knee paddleboard. What happened out there? You kept floating around. The wind's not good. Wind very bad, but the chicken fast. So yeah, how did you that was, like, a, that how was did you pretty like it, fun. Yeah, but how did you like it? Yeah, it was a, your first time on this one, right? I'm a water boy. I like it. When I see water, I love it. So yeah, I just think I took it on the knee, you know, uh, just to be safe. Yeah, you decided not to stand up. Oh, it was more like sit down pedal but, instead of stand up pedal. Yeah, but that doesn't matter. Anyway, I won. I think I had two minutes, almost one minute, and you had like six, seven minutes. On this one? Yeah. Three minutes and nine seconds. And 19 seconds? And, nine, 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 and 19, you had two yeah. minutes okay. and 15 seconds. Yeah, that's seconds. almost... No. Well, I think we can agree that maybe you won this one. It's fine. I can give you this one. You know, I, was, I just wanted to give you two easy tasks before, you know, and now... I ah, you wanted to give me a head start? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. So, but then I enjoyed it. All the challenge was nice, no? Yeah. Which one did you like the most? Oh, I think the fen fencing yeah, I think was, it's uh, yeah. was fun. Kronborg Castle is... Uh, Famous. It's, it's famous, like, yeah, you know, I think yeah. it's something that a lot of people would probably come visit if they, they would come here. It was three very different uh, tasks. Yeah. One where we had to stab each other, one where we had to 
copy each other, make food, and uh, one where we had to save the chickens. Yeah, it was super fantastic with good company. You know, it's way fun uh, hanging out. Thank you, Vin. You yeah. too. Thank you, man. <laughs> Visit Denmark. It's really nice.